The Queen is the one member of the royal family who may discuss how to resolve the difficult relationship between her two grandsons, commentators have claimed. The monarch may step up as a peacemaker when Prince Harry returns to the UK next month to help Prince William unveil a new statue for their mother, Princess Diana. Vanity Fair royal editor Katie Nicholl spoke to the royal beat, available on True Royalty TV, about how this could play out. She told the program, let's hope that there is some time for the talks that perhaps weren't able to take place last time around. The Queen is a brilliant peacemaker. She is the only person who can talk to Harry in a certain way and make him see sense. It has already been reported that the monarch has extended a lunch invitation for the Duke of Sussex when he is in the UK again. However, royal biographer Ingrid Seward was less optimistic about the Queen's plans to step in. She told the royal beat, I don't think she will though. I don't think for a moment any lunches will make any progress. It will be a proper lunch and very formal. Ms. Seward continued, The Queen hates moral confrontation. Partly because Shush has never had to deal with it in her life. Harry's trip overseas will mark the second time that he has been back in the UK this year, and since he and Meghan Markle left in 2020. The Duke travelled back to the country in April for the funeral of his grandfather, Prince Philip. According to reports, there was no great effort to repair the rift with his father or brother at the time. Royal commentators have pegged the unveiling of Diana's new statue in July as a moment for Harry and William to come together again. The memorial was commissioned by the siblings to mark what would have been the late Princess of Wales' 60th birthday. Although Harry is expected to mark the trip, reportedly the rest of the Sussex family will stay in the United States.